Hello mga ka Chicken Joy! Special thanks to all our 288 subscribers! Welcome to the OTB channel, your education and learning channel. So let's have a short blog video which is entitled how to apply at Bucor or Bureau of Corrections. And this is our magnificent topic of the day. Please don't forget to subscribe and be one of the 1,000 subscribers to win the surprise. So apply now. Bucor is hiring Corrections Officer 1 for its 2021 recruitment cycle. So how to apply at Bureau of Bureau of Corrections? The Bureau of Corrections is now accepting applicants for Corrections Officer 1 for 2021 re recruitment cycle. <coughs> they will be needing 1,000 correction officer, one personal for the year 2021 to strengthen its personal complement and further amplify its thrust towards the implementation of its twin mandates of safekeeping and reforming the country's national PDLs. Join the Bureau team, become a proud uniform officer, become a caring uniform reformer, become a correction officer one personal. Below are the minimum qualification as well as the documentary requirements for submission to the Bureau National Headquarters Human Resource Division or any human resource units of Bucor's six operating prison and penal farms, namely Correction Institution for Women, Mandaling City, 2. Sublime Prison and Penal Farm, Sublime Occidental, Mindoro. 3. Iwahig Prison and Penal Farm, Puerto Princesa, Palawan. 4. Leyte Regional Prison, Aboyog Leyte. 5. Double Prison and Penal Farm, Panabo City, Davao del Norte. 6. Ramon or San Ramon Prison and Penal Farm, Sambonga City. General qualifications for appointment to Corrections Officer 1. No person shall be appointed as uniform personal for the Bicor unless she or he possesses the following minimum qualifications. A citizen of the Republic of the Philippines, a person of good moral character. Must possess a baccalaureate degree from a recognized learning institution. Must possess the appropriate civil service eligibility. Must not have been dishonorably discharged or dismissal for cause from previous employment. Must not have been convicted by final judgment of an offense or a crime involving moral torpitude. Must not less than 21 or more than 40 years old of age must be 1 meter and 62 centimeters in height for male and 1 meter and 57 centimeters for female. Provided that a waiver is issued by the National Commission of Indigenous People or NCIP for height and age requirements is granted to applicants belonging to the cultural minorities or communities. The age limit per as per RA 10575, the Bureau of Corrections Act of 2013 is 40 years old. However, those above 36 years old of age will have to sign a waiver agreeing that they may not be able to qualify for the, for the full requirement benefits affordable to a uniform officer of Bucor. Requirements prior to submission of folders applicants must secure the following 1. BAR number 2. Pagibig number 3. Fill up number 4. Photocopy of updated and back clearance Documentary requirements Correction officer applicants long white folder Correction technical officer applicants long brown folder Non-uniform personal applicants long yellow folder one folder for application, tab A, letter of intent. Please address your letter of intent to USIC and uh, General Q, Gerald Q. Bantag, Director General NBP's Reservation, Barangay Poblacion, Mountain Lupa City, from Mr. Theodore R. Perez, Acting Chief Human Resource Division. B, five original and authorized original copies of duly accomplished CSC Form 212, revised 2017 personal data sheet or PDS, refer to the guide of filing out the PDS. Two copies of authenticated certification of eligibility or CSC or PSC and its official receipt. 
the authenticated copy of transcript of records and authenticated certification from the school or chat. E original PSA birth certificate official receipt to be presented. Original PSA marriage certificate if applicable. Original PSA birth certificate of children if applicable. One valid original NBA clearance. One valid PNP directorate of intelligence. The I clearance from Crom Crame. Folder for Bucor 2D. Duly properly accomplished PDS must be not notarized. Please refer to the guide to. Uh, to filing out the PDS. Original copies of clearances from the following agencies, one NBA clearance, one PNP DI clearance, one local police clearance, one barangay clearance, one RDC MTC persecution clearances. CPSA birth certificate, PSA marriage certificate if married, education certificate, certificate of employment, passport, notarized waiver authority to allow this agency to undergo PI. Sketch of house residence from landmarks, two latest two color two by two, then requirements C to G may submitted as photocopies. Folder for selection board, 12 photocopies of original PDS, folder of attestation, notarized and duly accomplished CSE form 20, uh, I mean 212 revised 2017, authenticated certification of eligibility or CSE or PSC. Then this is the background investigation authorization. Then the salary is correction officer one will receive a basic monthly salary of 29,668. Upon oath taking, the written qualify examination pursuant to Section 34 RA 11131 or the Philippine Criminology Professional Act of 2018, registered criminologists are exempted from the taking their written qualify examination and will immediately be scheduled for the neuropsychiatric examination criminology graduates holding eligibility such as csc professional eligibility as well as applicants from other disciplines will have to take the wqe as the initial screening step of the recruitment process how to apply work in applicants applicants ma may submit the requirements placed in a folder properly tab and labeled to the bureau in HQ's Human Resource Division or any of its Human Resource Units in the six oper operating prison and penal forms subject to guidelines of the concerned LGUs. The Bureau Human Resource Division shall not accepting walk-in applicants for the duration of ACQ. You may send the application folders through registered courier services for submissions. For couriers, send your application folder through registered courier service to one of the address listed below the human resource division bureau Bu bureau of corrections barangay montinlupa apoblacion montinlupa city 1776 iwahik prison and penal farm puerto princesa palawan 5301 sublime prison and penal farm barangay malisbo sublime occidental mendoro 5104 Later regional prison aboy aglite 6510 Davao Prison and Penal Farm, B.E. to Holly, Panabo City, Davao del Norte, 8105. San Ramon Prison and Penal Farm, Citrus San Ramon, Barangay, Telescience, and Mga City, 7000. <laughs> through email, applicants may also submit this, their scan documents through email at buker2021recruitment at gmail.com. Applicants who submit scan documents through email will have to present them once they schedule for any of the qualify qualifying steps. Reminder, if the applicant does not meet the high requirements, waiver shall issue the National uh, Commission of Indigenous People and must attach the folder one and submission. Without this application, will not qualify for the uniform personal positions. All right, so uh, we have here the website and the page and they have also the Human Resource Division number. So thank you for watching guys and please subscribe and be one of 1000 subscribers to win the surprise. To Jesus Christ, the good shepherd, be all the glory from John 10, 11. So it's time to say goodbye now and God bless. See you next time on here in our channel. Bye.